that the room for improvement is always this huge. Now, before I go, government and industry are being urged to bridge market gaps to facilitate the growth of entrepreneurs who specialize in technology. According to the founder of Hack Lab Foundation, Foster Akugri, the inability of these techpreneurs to access ready markets stifles progress and defeats the purpose of local content policies and regulations. He was speaking with Inshira Ado on the Big Conversation, a segment of the Business Connect show. It requires industry, academia and government to play a significant role to get it to where it is. I, I was having a debate with someone the last time and I was saying that amongst all the challenges entrepreneurs face are two things, access to market and access to finance. If I give you all the training, we build all the finest innovation centers and train people and they do not have access to market, there's no point they'll die. Mm. If you give them everything they need, including money, and they do not have access to market, they'll die. So. You can provide everything for them, but if you don't solve these two major things, then there's no point starting the journey, right? So industry needs to play that role of increasing local content consumption. Mm -hmm. Let's minimize important domain experts from different countries where you have to spend money to fly them in, spend money, they, their rates are way higher, we lose money on foreign exchange because we have to pay them in foreign currencies, right. etc. Why not find people in country who are far more competitive pricing? If you use initiatives like hackathons as your procurement process, so you always do an open call where you minimize the red tip that says you should be a business that has run for 10 years, you should have audited reports, uh, audited finance, etc., etc., before you can bid for a contract. Well, you can watch the full interview later tonight on Business Connects, which airs this and every Monday at 9 p.m. on Joy Prime. That will be it for me for now. I'm back after 8. There's sports and Israel will continue.